Global happenings today. We communicate. We analyze global news. Stay tuned. Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to Global Happenings Today. This is Politicking Area. This is Election Night Period. And a lot is in the radar. A lot of people are insinuating quite a lot of things. Some days back, it was a case of Peter OB where IPOP, Indigenous People of Biafra, had um, some sort of information that if anything on tours happened to Peter OB, then they should expect the, the country not to be in peace. Well, it looks like the Yoruba, the Southwesterners are not left out, as they seem to also have a classified information over their illustrious son, and this is what they have to say. But well, before we go into the news report, like you subscribe to our channel by clicking on the red subscribe button. Beside it, you will see a bell notification icon. Please go ahead, click on it to get notified as soon as we update our channel on YouTube. Let's go straight into the news. Um, a Southwestern social political group, Yoruba Council Worldwide, also known as Igbemo Akoko Yoruba Lagbayi, has said nothing political class wants scheme to wants to scheme to out of 2023 race. The group alleges that some northern political class are making the plans after their third attempt to install Lawan as the APC flag bearer in 2023 presidential elections. The council said it will not tolerate the, the kind of political treatment meted on Obafemi Awolowo and MQ Abiola on Tinubi. On Tunubu, uh, a social political group in southwest Nigeria, Yoruba called um, Lagbayi, that's Igbamo Akuko Lagbayi, has uh, alleged a plot to do this. Report has it that the group said that the northern political class had concluded plans to ensure that the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress APC uh, is out of the presidential race. At a briefing in Abuja, the president general of the council. Oladotu Hassan said the council has reliable information on the plots to repeat the political treatment method on Mobafemi, Awolo Wanemko Abiola, to ensure Atiku Abubakar succeed President Muhammad Buhari. Atiku is the presidential candidate of the opposition People's Democratic Party, that's PDP. Still, the group alleged that the northern supremacists have, have, result, have resorted to to pursuing Tinubu's disqualification through the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC. The council said Northern Power, power Brokers re realized the fortality of the attempt to impose Sen Senate President Ahmed Lawan as the presidential candidate of the APC. Hassan also claimed a plan to launch a media war against Tinubu over his missing academic certificate. He warned the council would not, he warned that the council would not tolerate any premeditated treachery against the former governor of Lagos State. Hassan, while speaking to journalists, said, and I quote him, we won against the ensuing and deadly political card by the Northern supremacist, supremacist and the sectional interest targeted explicitly at forcing Asiwaju Bola Ahmed Tunubu, the presidential candidate of All Progressive Congress APC, out of the way to pave the way for a Northern presidential candidate of another political party. We are fully unundotted with details of the deceitful and clandestine operations operations to desperately and forcefully bring in through the back door Alahaji Atiku Abubakar of the PDP and back him to emerge as president in 2023. The Yoruba Council Worldwide wishes to inform that we shall not tolerate any clandestine motive to repeat the evil machinization method out on Obafemi Awolowo and MK Abiola. Both of them were politically wrecked by the power thirsty northern supremacists who are hell bent on retaining power to the north or in the north under any political party divide. Uh, this is quite interesting. Uh, but uh, in, in the related news, report has it also that Tinubu of APC has replied the candidate of the PDP at Bubaka over his comment on his inability to choose a permanent running mate at INEX to pull a deadline. Atiku in a statement has said that the office of the president requires someone with clarity of purpose who can decide on his running mate on time. Tinubu in his reaction said it is unfortunate that Atiku and PDP made such statements rather than paying attention to tackling the internal crisis. Eee, this is serious. All right.
Okay, but um, let's look at this critically. A lot of Nigerians have been reacting. We're going to take one or two. Then we look at this very critically. Uh, this one here is saying he is not even supposed to be in the race at all. My God. Another person said, great Yoruba leaders, stop pursuing the agenda that will not pay Yoruba masses. Let us shut down the voyage of election in 2023 and put an end to master slave constitution of 1999 constitution. Another person here is saying, that's a good lesson for the so-called educated Yoruba people and the uneducated Muslim in the North. It is a shame on, uh, I don't know, but let's, let's keep that. And that person here says, so the, so the inconsistencies in the certificate should be overlooked because he's a Yoruba man. That's another thing. You know, let, let's let's leave propaganda aside, okay? It, it it doesn't pay for us to turn every issue that should be scrutinized as propaganda. Regardless of who owns the certificate, Nigerians have the right to know uh, the qualifications of their candidates, of their aspirant, so that Nigerians, the citizens or the electorate, can vote wisely based on the information available to them. This is a, 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 a two-time governor of Lagos State, uh, has held some strong political position. They call him, Jacob, they call him the Jagaban of Lagos. Okay, so he's a very strong current card current member of APC and he has strongholds in um, Lagos State and he has so many uh, prodigies he has raised in political palace, political scene. So yes, it's, you could call him godfather in politics in Nigeria. So if at the level at the level and the rate where he is, he can't produce um certificate or information that should make him screened without even raising an eyebrow is what being worried over nigerians need credible people i'm not saying he's not credible but if he says he has certificates that took him through second primary secondary school and he turned that same in chicago university by all means even if he can't tender it but at least he can give us dates all right that, that makes sense it doesn't sound like propaganda I think every Nigerian is interested to know who the next president is and his pedigree. Yes, you could say he has been tested on leadership count of the truth, but we want we don't want to be seen Olu only kind of certificate or the one that does not even exist at all. Nigerians are tired of the status quo. We are tired of um, uh, being played out. All right, Nigerians want something that looks like the real deal. And it is the real deal. So don't let us begin to think that everything that requires scrutiny has to be um, a, an attack on your candidacy. Everyone will be thrown open. Okay? Uh, it, at the time of uh, electionary uh, campaigning, everyone, okay? Look, it's a collective feature of everyone. Don't begin to vote on, on regional lines or party lines or on the grounds of, oh, it's my ethnic brother. You're going to put every Nigerian in trouble. We want the best. If Astuadu is the best, by all means, we vote for him. He needs to show Nigerians that he has the capacity and he has the tenority, he has what the, 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 the qualification to do that. And it all begins from now. So, that they have decided to scrutinize him. It is, even if they don't scrutinize him APC, at some point, Nigerians will ask questions. And nobody wants to make the same mistake that was made years back that drove Nigerians to where, it, where she is right now. That's what we're going to wrap it up. Let's meet in our conversation. What's your take? Do you believe this is pure propaganda? Or do you think there's a sinister move really to oyster out as you are Let's interact. Do I have it?